What's up, guys? The Keeper Productions here, and today we're gonna be doing uh, how to wash your goalkeeper, how to wash your goalkeeper gloves. And the ones that I have on right now are the West Coast goalkeeper, West Coast goalkeeping gloves. I currently still have them in my package, like as it came. I still have them in the package. Um, I've had them in this like since it first came. So like, um. I, I enjoy this. I really don't want them to throw away. One time, my coach really wanted to throw this away. He told me you don't need it. I told him yes, I do. I love this package. And what we'll be what we will be using is the West Coast glove wash. Like I said in my other my in my first video, the what's in my soccer bag. You can see this is by West Coast. The same the same goalkeeper glove company, and I bought this with my gloves because like with my gloves because I really need them. Um, um like. Since they're white, they need um uh, to be washed, you know. And let's get to this. So for step one, what we're gonna be doing is to rinse the glove. Like as, as you can see my right now, my glove is my glove is pretty dirty. Also the palm. You see right there. So so what we're gonna want to do first is rinse rinse it with the water. That's good. Just rinse everything right like that. Make sure your glove is soaked. Pick up some water, you know. And there you go. And uh, there's another rule for washing gloves. What you have to do, do not twist like do not twist the glove like that. Do not twist it. This can damage the palm and the glove. Just squish like, like that. Take out all the water. You can see the bubbles coming out. And then... Okay, now for step two is you're gonna... Once you have your water on, you're gonna want to take out all the dirt You're gonna want to take out all the dirt, like as you can see how I'm doing right now. Really gently, make sure you don't damage your, your goalkeeper gloves. So once you've gotten most of the dirt out of your glove, also on the back hand. So once you've gotten most of the dirt out, you're gonna want to put your um this, the West Coast glove wash. So let me add that. Okay, so all right, so we're gonna add some, not too much. Look how much I add. This is how much I add. That's how much I add. It's like a nick. It's like a nickel, pretty much like a little nickel. Okay. And then you're gonna rub you're gonna want to rub it gently in the palm. 
in the palm like that and then in the in the thumb like that and you're gonna want to do it in the fingers too like that get all the all the um the grip from the from the palm you're gonna want to put it in the fingers like that there you go okay and then like that there you go gently And we're gonna add a little bit, uh, just a little bit, not too much, to the back hand. Like, just like that, not too much. Not that much, like a little penny. As you can see there, like that. Rub it everywhere. I wanna get it clean. Just like that, and you're gonna want to take it back to here, and you're gonna rinse again with the water. Make sure you rinse to get everything like that, and you don't look now it's squishy. See, you see bubbles, right? You don't want to see bubbles there. You want to squish out all the bubbles like that. Just like that. Okay, so once you're done with all those steps, now you, you're, you're this this one you're gonna put a towel. You're gonna put a towel over in your glove like that. You can see like right there, and you're gonna want to put pressure on it so you can take out all the water. Like that is good. Like that. You wanna make sure all the water is out. Yeah. Okay, like that. And look, you can see the mark, the glove, because of the wetness. That means if you kind of see that, like that in your glove, that means you took out most of the water so it can be faster drying. Okay, so you're going to want to get your glove. And let me show you this. Let me show you something. If you hear this in your glove, that means you, you, got it, that means you gave it a really good wash. If you hear the squeak, like... If you gave it, if you hear that squeak, that means you gave your your glove a really good wash. And the last step, all right, the last step of this, okay. The last step is to get your glove, get your glove, and then. Okay, those are my dogs. Don't, okay, you're going to get your glove. Just make sure you do not put in direct sunlight. If you put in direct sunlight, this will damage your goalkeeper gloves. And make sure you can put in a place. Like, I put it here on my bench. You see, like, there's no direct sunlight on it. Or you can hang it here. Like, I have in this in my house. I can hang it like that. And there's no direct sunlight. You can see right there. Overnight, you're going to... 
You're gonna want to keep it 24 hours in there. And yeah, it will be dried. I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Make sure you like the video, subscribe, and leave a comment. Hope you... Um, yeah.